gang, it is January 14th, the day before my birthday. I'm about to head out. I'm actually going to my parents' house today. They got some things going on with their heater. They had one installed uh, last week. And I don't know if it's some miscommunication or what going on. But I got to go out and I'm going to check on them and see what the technicians are doing. I gotta do something about that. It's been like that for two days. I got an air compressor in the garage. It's just been too lazy to do it. I don't know what's up with that. I did install a mic back on my DJI cam today and I updated it also so the color should be more vibrant. Yeah, it goes. It's actually a nice day. Sun is out. And I gotta stop and get some gas, of course. And I got about, I guess about 45. All right, guys, we got the gas and I'm on my way. It's a really, really nice day out here. It's like 45 degrees, but it's beautiful. Probably about 15, I don't know, 10 minutes away from my parents. And I've got one job I'm gonna do today. One of my uh, other friends that's in the business gave me a call. He has a client that need a uh, raccoon trap so I'm gonna probably go put that trap out later on I'm not sure what time I'll try to get this wrapped up with my parents and then I'm headed back to the city my parents a few days ago got these guns and go out and test my mom's because my mom hadn't shot her but my dad shot his This testing, she had about, both of them had their guns about, I don't know, their new guns, well they had guns already, but they had these new guns about two, three months, and she never fired hers. My dad tested her, his, but she never tested hers. It was just a little 38. Um, I think they are titanium or something like this, real light. Feel like a toy. Got to really have these put up, because if not, um, kids will get this and think it's a toy. It's definitely not a toy, but it's really light. And they went with the one without the hammer, just in case you got it in a holster or something like that. When you go to pull it out, it doesn't grab. I used to really be into guns, but I'm not into them as much as I used to be. My hobbies change like the weather. All right, gang, I am back in the Memphis area. I got to go put out two traps. Got uh, two customers. Each one of them are having raccoon problems, so. I'm headed out now. Um, I gotta go put down one. I just picked up one from one of my other friends that's in the business. And I gotta go pick up another one from somewhere else. We're gonna get those traps put out and that's, that's pretty much gonna be it for the day. I got another customer I need to get to, but it's four o'clock and this stop is about uh, 28 minutes from where I am now. So it'll be dark shortly. So we're gonna call it after this one. Where is it coming in? See these trees right here lead right over in the one on the front. So that's, that's trees all around. So it's several areas that it can get off the top of the tree and go in. Those areas where some rodents could get in on that vent. Because when she told me the general area she was hearing it in, this was one of the ones we kind of just put the trap out and go. Reason being is because I don't have my contractors here today, so I can't get them to go on top of the house. And we are dealing with a uh, company, and they just want us to go ahead and do something to address it today. And if need be, we'll come back out tomorrow and a little bit farther in depth to 
see where the frit is going in. So I chose to put it here. Reason being, because this tree goes right up. It's easy for them to climb off. So if it is a raccoon, that's going to be the path that they're going to want to try to take. Versus like this tree, they would have to go up this tree and jump off. It's not that far, but they could make that also. But raccoons are quite a bit more lazier than squirrels. They're not going to do that much work. Whereas the squirrel will go right up that tree, jump off. They'll go right on his limb, jump off. Same with those trees, or that big tree. But that's it for this one. All right, guys, I didn't get a chance to get the last trap set because it was kind of late. So I told the customer I'll be back sometime tomorrow. So hopefully around one or two o'clock, I'll get back out there and get the trap set for them. And we'll be picking up something hopefully by Saturday morning. Today is Thursday, so hopefully by Saturday morning. And I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Till next time, this is Daylight Life Report.